This looks like the right address. I can't afford to mess that up again. It turns out most people don't appreciate a hunking hulk of creatures such as myself entering uninvited. Honestly, they're just missing out. Who needs some boring old goody two-shoes anyway? Uh, there's no fun in that. Hold on. Yeah, I'm sure this is the place. Just look at all those plushies on their bed. Definitely who I'm looking for. It looks like you've been marked down on the naughty list, sweetie. You know that deserves a punishment. Well, enough standing around out here. It's time to get my hands dirty. Straight down your chimney it is, then. Don't expect any visits from old Saint Nick tonight. Ah, uh, this is always my favorite part of the job. I just can't wait to see the look on their face once I enter. <laughs> what a wonderful sight. Ah, uh, this chimney is getting pretty tight. Damn, what the hell? It was so wide at the top. Ah, uh, it's fine. I'm almost here. I've just got to get my legs through at least. Maybe then I can fit my double-cheeked-up cake through this chimney. Might as well try. Nobody ever said being a mischievous holiday entity was an easy life. It will all be worth it once I see her face. Cower in fear at my very presence, darling. Tonight is going to be quite interesting for you. <laughs> now just let me pull myself out of here. I said just pull myself out. Uh, hold on. I can't move. My dummy thick cake is stuck outside the chimney. Whatever shall I do? Uh, surely I've awoken her by making all this noise. What's she going to think when she sees my dump truck stuck out of the fireplace in the middle of her living room? Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. Maybe if I just pretend like I'm not actually here, she won't notice. <sighs> no, that's stupid. I'll still be stuck. I still need someone to pull me out of here. Hmm. That's it. I'll just pretend to be a chimney sweep. That's not inconspicuous at all in the 21st century, right? Well, it's the best I've got. Oh no, here she comes. Uh... Excuse me, ma'am. I seem to be lodged in this fireplace orifice. Do you think you could, um, maybe pull on my rear a bit? I know this is a rather odd situation. I'm just a chimney sweep, madam. I was hired to clean this chimney. Of course we work at night. It would be rather inconvenient to clean during the day with all the home occupants up and about you now. Ah, well, someone hired me. You can't blame a working man for doing his job. Listen, please. Just to help pull me out of here. It's getting hard to breathe. Do you know how much paperwork you have to fill out if a death occurs on your property? Yeah, that's right. So you better help me out before I suffocate. Just grab my stupid thick caboose from behind and pull on it. I should be able to get out of here if I just have a bit more leverage. <sighs> You're gripping me so tight. Who knew a stranger could be so rough? Mm, I'm almost there. Just pull a little harder. Uh, Alright, I'm sliding out. Just keep going a little harder. Mm, here I come, darling. Oh my. That was intense. Are you alright, my dear? I didn't crush you with my fat ass, did I? Oh, good. That's a relief. Thank you for the assistance, my dear. You are so kind. Too bad you're on the naughty list this year. <laughs> I can't believe you really fell for the whole chimney sweep thing. But I'm quite glad you did. <laughs> My job is quite a bit easier with your assistance. Oh, come now. 
Don't even pretend like you don't know what you did. I think you know exactly why I'm here. And I think you know exactly what I'm going to do to you. You naughty girl. Look, still don't believe me? This is your name, right? Hmm, I think you're a new addition to this list, hmm? I can't recall seeing your face before. That's alright. It seems when someone is put on the naughty list once, they never seem to want to leave. I wonder why that is. My punishments only get harsher every year. Just because this is your first time, don't think I'll go easy on you. I think a naughty girl like you deserves to have some proper punishment every once in a while. I'll give you exactly what you deserve. Hm. No getting out of it now, dear. Might as well just accept your fate and enjoy. I just can't wait to see that cute little face of yours when I start. Hm. Nowhere to run now, dear. I think you knew your fate would catch up eventually. Are you trying to tell me you seriously don't know what you did? Come on now, don't give me that. I'm surprised a monster like you can even sleep at night. <laughs> it says here that you committed the grave offense of putting the toilet paper towards the wall when replacing the roll. Ugh, seriously, I can't believe someone would do such a thing. I thought you humans were over that crime already. Apparently not you, and millions of others for that matter. <sighs> anyway, you didn't think you'd get off scot-free for that little maneuver, did you? Well, I guess you should have thought harder. <clears throat> now I just can't wait to punish a little cutie like you. So don't keep me waiting. I can administer it wherever you like. So you might as well get comfy first. I saw that bed of plushies you have. That's how I knew a little deviant like you lived here. Hell, I wouldn't be surprised if you actually enjoyed your little punishment. You certainly are the type. <laughs> Either way, I know I'm going to enjoy it. Say, you seem rather enthusiastic all of a sudden. You didn't by chance purposely misbehaved this year, did you? Oh, it's just a theory. It's fine. You can keep your little naughty thoughts to yourself. I was summoned to give out some punishment either way. Cuties like you are always my favorite. I always love the ones that accept their fate. It makes it so much more pleasant when they aren't constantly trying to exercise me from their home. What do they think I am? Some sort of poltergeist? <sighs> Not that I mind taming some of those ferals from time to time, but sometimes it gets old after the three millionth time. But I must say, you do seem quite pleasant. Even with as many houses as I have to visit tonight, I wouldn't mind staying a bit longer with you. You did help me out with the whole chimney situation. Maybe you deserve some special punishment for that. But you might think of it more as a reward. <laughs> you may even consider your regular punishment as a reward, I suppose. That's fine. I want to see a look of pure ecstasy on your face anyway. That would truly make my night. A sweetie like you deserves to have a good time. <laughs> well, go ahead. Lead me in, darling. I want to turn this room of yours into an impromptu dungeon. <laughs> My, you have wonderful taste already, dear. This is just the sort of place a proper punishment can be performed. The atmosphere is half the battle after all, my darling. Where's the fun if it doesn't give off a dark yet comforting feeling? Exactly. You seriously are just my type. <laughs> oh, it's nothing. I just wouldn't mind snatching up a cutie like you and taking you as my present. Mm, something tells me you wouldn't mind that either. Tell you what. Think of this little session as a trial run. 
You can test me out and see just how you like me. And then after that, we can decide on how this works long term. Tell me, does that sound good to you? Of course it does, dear. Trust me, it sounds even better to me. Something tells me you've already decided what you want. In that case, you'll get the full experience. Now lean over the damn bed. How wonderful you look spread out from behind like this. I brought my very special device just for this circumstance. What sort of whimsical winter cryptid would I be without my birch rod punishment device? I think your ass deserves a few whacks for your devious crimes. Hmm, <laughs> look at you. Already leaning into it before I've even started. Such an eager one, aren't you? Keep that pose, darling. This won't hurt a bit. Isn't that nice, dear? Hmm, how I enjoy seeing your face with every hit. Hmm, I love seeing the way you lean into it with every hit. You know, you're kind of a slut, aren't you? How adorable. Don't take that as an insult, my dear. I think you're perfect. So just keep taking it like that, okay? I promise you you're... Other punishment, mm, reward, mm, will be even better than this. We haven't even gotten started. I want to show you all the possibilities we have together, sweetie. And I want to make sure you enjoy every second of this. Mm, I think you've been tenderized enough now, my dear. I think I want to move you into stage two. Those pants are hindering your experience. I can most certainly help you out with those, dear. Feel me get right behind you. Mm, how do you like that feeling? Feel me reach down and help you. Whoops. Looks like they just slipped right off. Mm. Now I can show you what I really do with those naughty enough.